Oh, it's right there! Oh, sh uh, there's snow on the ground, as you can see, but uh, it's raining. It's the last time we went camping in the rain, we came back. And I should have cleaned out, cleaned out all of my stuff that same day, but I waited like a whole day and everything got moldy. It looks like the spot we're gonna go camping at. It's closed. What do you want to do? What's our elevation? It's not that high, huh? 2,300. Let's go check out that spot where the snowmobiles turned into. Yeah. So. yeah. Well, it's open to them, but we don't, <laughs> this is open to them too, though. So, yeah. yeah. So, we'll, we'll, yeah, as long as we can find a, a few of the mountains that's on that side. Yeah. That We're going to go back to that spot where we just passed. What? Uh, so, plan B is a no-go? All right, what do you want? Uh, go to the other spot right by the reserve campsite. So here goes uh, plan C. Hopefully plan C isn't closed off. Doesn't look like it. Tony's driving in there. Let's see what it looks like when we get beyond this. Sign for snow park. Parking by snow park permit only. Huh. Josh, this is where we at last time. You can't go beyond that point, huh? So A, B, and C are all uh, bus. So where, uh, where's the next spot? Well, this is where uh, Doug and all of us went uh, over landing last time. Yes, it's the same spot there. If, it, if, uh, if they didn't block it up with the snow, that we could have gone straight. Uh, okay. Well, let's just head on down the road and see if there's anything else to open. Well, I was going to try to do that one nearby the river, but the, they pushed all the snow to the access down by the river, uh, by the lake. Alright, so, still not sure where we're going. Stampede Pass? The what? I said Stampede Pass then? Yeah, we might as well. We can go, to, go over there. Yeah, yeah, let's give it a try. Stampede Pass or Lake Catches. Or uh, even that little island, if we can make it in, into that little island. So it looks like we're gonna go to this, uh, the lake catches. It's gonna be back towards the house, which is good. We'll see. Still on, so I see it on my uh, map on here, but hopefully it's not so far to a point to where I can't get to it. Oh my goodness, how did I go and do that? I'm really hoping that the tree is right by the tree line. Yeah, it doesn't even look like I'm getting too close to it. it must be all the way out there. I'm gonna try to walk out there, so we'll see, we'll see if, uh, shoot. So, I don't know if you can see the little map, but looks like it's on the ground at least. But I do not see where it's at, so we're gonna have to go look for it. Great, good job. Damn it, where'd that map go? I'm hoping it fell on the ground and not be uh, not stuck in the tree. I'm hoping it's somewhere right here along this tree line. Gotta see where that's at. Put this thing away because these rocks are slippery. Oh shit. Okay, I gotta put you away for a minute. Closer. Stand, let me see here. Turn. Swim on turn. Right here. Oh! Oh, like right here somewhere. Right there. Where are you at, drone? How high did I fly? I don't know. Um, it says 91 feet. 
Uh, gotta be up on the tree, huh? I don't know. We'll see. I'm getting close to it, though. It must be in this tree right here. No, this one right here. It's in this tree. Damn it. I'm gonna have to climb the tree. Maybe I can shake it. <laughs> it's small enough. Where'd that drone go? Yep, definitely in this tree. You can see that. Up in this tree. Let's see if I can find it. <sighs> yeah, definitely this tree. Okay. Let's see if I can see it. 91 feet, but isn't, that's 91 feet above sea level though, so it's got to be on like a low branch or something. I do not see that damn thing. Huh. The heck did it go? I wonder if it's... Is it that tree or is it this tree? Let me see here. Yeah, definitely now. I'm all, oh, you know what? Maybe it's actually in this tree. Maybe this tree. Ah, which tree is this? One of these three trees. Yeah, it's still on. Does it beep? Uh, I don't know. Let me see if, make it beep somehow. No, I'm not sure. It's in the Gonna seem like it's in this tree. Oh, it's right there! Oh, fell on the ground! Hoo-hoo! Hoo-hoo! Hoochie mama! Ooh, look at that! I found it! I don't know if it's any good, it looks kind of jacked up, but I found it on the ground! Oh, man! I did get luck. Luckily, I left it on and GPS thing works. Oh, look at that! Yeah! Look at that! Time to turn it off. Turn it off quick. Look at all this. Oh, it broke a propeller, but that's okay. That was the first one. Yeah, at least I got the drone. See, it fucked the propeller. They can have all of it. Wow, I'm like super excited now. Oh, crap. I don't know if it's good anymore. Let's see if I can fix it. Well, I'll fix it down there, but hold on. <laughs> oh, it must have hit pretty hard. The freaking plastic right there came loose. You can see right there. That, that came loose. That yeah, must have hit the tree pretty hard. Let's see if I can. Hold on, let me see if I can push this thing back together real quick. So it doesn't break anymore. Oh, you break your bye. No more flying sideways for me. Okay, I'm gonna take it down there and try to fix it down there. I got my drone back. Uh, it's kind of beat up a little bit from the fall or the crash. I'm not sure which one. Um, but. At least I got it back, and then uh, so that gives me a chance to um, try to fix it. So we'll see if it's fixable at camp, because I need a torque screw to undo some of the parts. Um, I mean, it doesn't look too bad, but Danny's fell and or hit a tree and fell off, and it wasn't work. It didn't work after Tony risked his life to get that one so we'll see we are heading back out now back to lake hitches okay so i'm back now using the bathroom get out of here yeah, right back there yeah i had to use the bathroom copy that Yeah, so hopefully uh, I'm able to fix that drone. If not, I don't know. Maybe I'll have to get the Mavic 3 or something. Upgrade, full upgrade. It's only 311, but it gets dark by like 4 or 5. Just took the exit. It wasn't far. I think it was like maybe 4 or 5 exits away from our last spot. And this is 4 or 5 exits closer uh, to home. Yep, I see it. Road closed. Did you think uh, Kinchella's this exit or no? Uh... I don't know. I mean, we can give it a try. It doesn't. Looks like they pushed up the snow to where you can't really go that route, anyways. So, uh, turn around. I doubt Coachella's is prob probably open. I'm thinking maybe we have to go back to Greenwater. So, here we go again. Next spot. Do you know what that means? Oh, yeah, it's already closed. Yep, it's already closed. It's our alternative to this. 
It's gonna be about a good 45 minutes to an hour away. We have to basically cross the whole um, area. I don't know what you wanna call it, but we had to go off of I-90 to 18 to Enumclaw. Plans A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, and all the other good stuff uh, were blocked off. So we're gonna go back to the Lonesome Lake area. And now it looks like it's starting to snow. Got the camp. I think Tony set up his awning. Got the fire going. Got the awning going. I was going to put mine up, but then the sky looks, uh, I can't see stars up there, so I don't think I'm going to put mine up. So we're going to cook because we've been driving around for like five hours without <laughs> eating. Woo Literally five hours. Yeah, five hours. Ever since 12. What time is it now? Six? Seven? Yeah, yeah. It's like six, six, six. yeah so yeah, we've been doing it for a minute. We're going to drink some pop, eat, because we hungry. This is what we cook. We got some homemade clam chowder from Ivers. Yeah. <laughs> yep, you know it. And then ooh, the fucking bag ripped. And then we got some shrimpies. Oh yeah. Yeah. But the oop. One fell out. One shrimp. Mm -hmm. Well yeah, he didn't try to get away. But the star of the show is this guy. Oh yeah. Uh huh. No. Yeah, it's like a big ass chunk of ribeye steak. Oh, no. <laughs> right? <laughs> oh, here goes the. You don't need the foil, right? No, no. Okay, I'll throw it away then. Yeesh. That's gonna take a minute to cook, but that's why I brought the shrimp too, though. Yeah, I never cooked the tomahawk. That's why I told you guys I never cooked that before, but this is a bigger piece, yeah, bigger it. chunk, less likely to dry out. Yeah. Ooh, like magic. Well, it's been a while. Yeah. See all the burns. Yeah, I think it's probably got to... Got to burn off right? Yeah, burn off the... <laughs> I think I can see that. But yeah. It's got all the way for the other part of the burner to, to open up a little bit. We are going to cook up some shrimp. For appetizers. Some oil on there. What the hell did that? Oh. Okay, maybe I should have... Oops. Oh, damn it! <laughs> That's not good. I just dropped the... Uh, just dropped the... I just dropped the plastic piece into the thing. Damn it! I'm supposed to keep it uh, waterproof. <laughs> so now I gotta leave it out because I don't want oil to get everywhere. I've got all of it over here. <laughs> oh no no! I I got enough oil. It's just freaking uh, that that plastic thing fell in there. That's supposed to make it waterproof. The lid yeah. waterproof. Yeah. It just freaking fell in there. Should be hot enough. Sounds like it. Pepper. <laughs> Some uh, garlic powder. <laughs> Some cayenne. Maybe I should have picked the potatoes first. Yeah, they took a little bit. Oh, too late for that now, Josh. Oh, could have said something well, in the no, beginning. No, no. I was trying those. to make the fire. You could actually, <laughs> you could actually throw those off the side. Yeah. I just don't want it to overcook. Yeah. yeah. I'll probably throw the cooked looking ones around the edges. And then, uh, so I still got cut up the potato, uh, the potatoes. You want to just throw them in the fire? Throw them in the fire? Yeah, wrap them mm. in. Throw them in 
And, oh, uh, no, no, let, let's cut them up. Because otherwise, yeah, that's going to take a minute, too. Even if you throw it in the fire, wrapped up in aluminum, it's like a baked potato. Good. If we cut them up, it'll uh, help, help cook faster. Into a plate so we don't overcook it. Josh over here cutting up the taters. All right, Tony's over here prepping up the pork belly. Costco? Yeah. Oh, but yeah, let's do a shot. I'll wait. That's. This is that pork, mmm, pork belly. Ooh, look at all that fatty goodness. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> you gotta use all this oil up. Because <laughs> I don't want it to leave. Oh man, everything tastes like truffles. I don't know why. <laughs> Some more garlic right here. Went out. But we still have this though. Excellent! Excellent! <laughs> they want to make use cheap parts and charge you for an arm and a leg for fuck. I fucking raided there. Shrimp in there. What is done? That's got to heat it up. Shrimp on the bar. Creatures came out and oh. everything. And then uh, the father only had like. Still hot? Right? Yep. Yeah. I'm going to see some, some of the taters for, uh, watch more call it, for the steak too. There you go. Happy birthday! Birthday dinner. Oh, really? Yeah. There's more shrimp too if you guys want some more. So, here. Shove off of there. Uh huh. Mm. Mm hmm. Tony? Good, you don't need a salt. No, it came from the sea. It came from, yeah, it did. It did. It's got sea salt. Yeah, mm -hmm. <laughs> got the sea salt. Oh, you say, mm -hmm. My dog oh I didn't hear this. I didn't hear this here. Oh, it was hot enough. No, it's hot Let's enough. move the uh, I think, are you sure? Because I didn't hear this here. No, that's fine. It didn't see her though. No, you got if it doesn't see her, that's it. a bad sign. That's a bad time. I'm just saying it's a bad time. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna move the stuff off the tumbo so I can watch my father. Oh that didn't make <laughs> Oh yeah, that's it right there. Mm. I got plenty of time. That's an oh, that's some brown one right there. Oh, stick it on the flame. Take it off with that because we want everything hot and warm and nice and toasty. 
I forgot what I did with my knife. You got a knife, Tony? All right. I forgot where my knife went, but. Yeah. Ooh, we brother chop this. Josh, where you go? Oh, how is it? Is it good? Good, good. Oh, here, here. Here, Josh. Uh, here, grab that one. You gotta do it for the camera too, though. Oh, no. Is that it? Oh, it's got a little crunch on the Oh, it's got the clear. crunch? Mm. Oh, it's got the added texture. Perfect. Perfect. Ah, I like my shit salty, that's why I'm... In the mornings, you know, ate a little bit of breakfast from what we had left over last night. Um, now we're on our way home. It snowed quite a bit. Um, maybe not too much, maybe an inch. But uh, it's coming down right now. Helps with the traction. Hey, thank you for watching. And thank you for staying till the end. I appreciate that. And be sure to hit the like and subscribe if uh, you want to see more. Peace out.